In this video, we're going to take a look at a method that can be used to find the prime factorization of a number. A prime factorization is simply a product of primes. The way we find a prime factorization is we start dividing by prime numbers. To divide by prime numbers, it'll be useful to know a few prime numbers that are divisible by only one in itself. These would be the numbers like 2, 3, 5, 7, 11, 13, 17, 19, and on and on. Notice each of these numbers is only divisible by 1 and itself. Let's take a look at some examples where we divide by primes to find this prime factorization. To find a prime factorization, I'll put an upside-down division bar as we divide this by a prime number. The smallest prime number is 2, and you'll notice that 1350 is even, and so it must be divisible by 2. 2 goes into 1350 675 times. You might notice that this number ends in a 5. That would suggest we can divide the 625 by 5, or 675. When we do, we get 135. Again, that ends in a 5, and so I'm going to divide by 5 a second time. This leaves me with 27, which we know is divisible by the prime number 3. This leaves me with 9, which we know is divisible by the prime number 3. This leaves me with 3, which we know is divisible by the prime number 3, which leaves me with 1. Once we have 1 at the bottom of our division problem, we now can find the prime factorization by listing the product of the numbers we found. We have a 2 as a factor. Notice there were 3 3's. We can write this using an exponent as 3 to the 3rd power times 5. Notice the 5 is on there twice, so we'll say 5 squared. The prime factorization of 1350 is 2 times 3 cubed times 5 squared. Using this method, it doesn't matter which number you divide by in which order, as long as you're always dividing by a prime number. So let's try another problem and see if we can find the prime factorization of 168. You might notice that 168 is divisible by 2, 84 times. This is again divisible by 2, 42 times, which is again divisible by 2, 21 times. 21 is divisible by 3, 7 times, and 7 is divisible by 7, 1 time. We can now use these numbers to list out the prime factorization. 2 to the 3rd power, because we have 3 factors of 2, times 3, times 7, is the prime factorization, or the list of prime numbers, that multiply to 168.